All right, we're gonna take Daisy. Come on, Daisy. Come on, baby. We're gonna take Daisy out and back where the fresh mint pile is. Hey, where's my dongle? Mom. Hey, everybody. Welcome back. Thanks for joining in. Today, we're gonna do something a little different. If you saw my first video, you'll see that I was down in my basement getting ready for a book sale on Instagram for July 7 and 8. That's pretty much all set. I'm actually gonna start the sale tonight. If you wanna join along with that, go to Instagram, follow along 518 Vintage Girl, and you'll see everything that I post. And you may actually find one or two good summer reads. So I invite you to do that. Don't, I keep, keep turning my head. My doodle's out here, Daisy the Ditsy Doodle. She's running around. I don't let her out too much in the summer because it's so hot. We actually have two doodles, but it's a very, very hot, humid day here. But I thought I'd get her out a little bit. So I may be a little distracted, sorry about that, because I have to keep my eye on her because if I don't, she's gonna be in the woods. But any rate, let's get back to the video and what I plan on doing. I have to display and stage a lot of the items that I sell. So what I'd like to do is I know there's a lot of other people out there that sell a lot of people do have a hard time I see you know with taking pictures and how they want to display their items that they sell so what I'm what I plan on doing is giving some tips uh, just a few ideas out there as to how a nice display should be put together um, in the hopes that this will help you sell more items let's enter my barbecue area. Actually, it's my husband's barbecue area because I'm usually inside doing prep work while he's out here grilling. So, these are the glasses right here that I'm going to be working with today to show you. These are vintage Calvert Gin iced tea drinking glasses. They're actually really cool. You cannot buy these in stores. These are from the 1970s and I have a set of four. So, I mean, I could do a you know quick little photo, put these on my shop, but that's not gonna that's not gonna sell the glasses. Okay, so the first thing you want to do when you set up a display and you want to sell something, you have to think about the location, the time of day. Um, I never, excuse me, I'm gonna be swatting mosquitoes. I never shoot in the direct sunlight. I prefer to shoot on cloudy days because shadows are low on those days at least around my property they are if you shoot in the direct sunlight it's going to change the color then you really have to fiddle with your color um, on your camera and sometimes that's not a true, re true representation of what the item you're trying to sell so that's why I chose our barbecue area and over here you'll see um, we have a little setting area a little teak table uh, bar height table and a couple chairs so let me show you what I've chosen these are the glasses like I said um, this is a set of four <clears throat> Calvert Gen um, iced tea glasses I want to sell it would be very boring you know you could just set them on a counter but again that would be very boring so we need some props I brought a it's a small cake cupcake plate this would would give you height if I want to do something uh, with the glasses in front and the glass on top. I picked fresh mint, which I immediately put in water because as you can see, it's starting to wilt. So uh, wilt, wilty herbs do not look good in photo shoots. So I'm gonna see if I can bring that back. If I can't, I'm gonna run down real quick and pick some new stuff. A nice pitcher of cold water, which is great on a hot day, um, lemonade, whatever you wanna use, and one glass full of water with ice in it. I brought a tablecloth. It may look, this table over here may look better if it's dressed up a little bit. So I brought a real pretty vintage tablecloth out. And I brought out a set of luncheon plates. Again, these are nice vintage herbal plates that also can be used in the display. Okay, you're gonna see how I set this up. There's a few things that I had to take away. I had to take away the tablecloth. It was too small for the table and it just didn't look right. And you don't wanna cob something. Uh, the other item I, I took away from the um, display area was the white pedestal um, cake stand. It was just too tall. It didn't fit in. So 
What I came up with, I had to add a couple things. I needed some color, because I just have the green and white. I went in my cellar, which I have almost, it's like a bargain, it's like Filene's bargain basement. I went down there and pulled some real pretty blue summer napkins um, I'm gonna be selling in my shop also, which will work out well, because I can also advertise them. And the other thing I grabbed, I am using the, the four dishes, and I grabbed some straws, again, to add some color. So this is the display that I came up with. I think it's inviting. I think it will draw you in. I've already taken my photos for my Etsy shop. What you wanna do is, again, you wanna make it inviting, you wanna bring people in, you want them to get the idea that, hey, this is how I would like to entertain. So what I did was, because I had four glasses, I chose uh, the four, the four sandwich plates, which again will be displayed. I'll use the same display, but I will be advertising um, my plates in my Etsy shop. I have six, but if you have four glasses, remember you want to use four plates. The same thing, I have four napkins stacked here for the color, and I have four straws. Don't get carried away um, with a lot of extra things. You want to keep the focus on the glasses. You also want to make sure that if you use a pitcher, um, and these are drinks, you want to have your pitcher full. You want to make sure that the ice is in there, the mint would add flavor, you can use lemonade, you could use Kool-Aid if you want some color. I want to keep this fresh and clean because it's a hot summer day and everybody wants a nice cold glass of water. So, with that being said, I think it turned out to be a really nice display. It's a nice setting. I think it's very inviting. And it's definitely a place I would like to be invited to. Well, I think I accomplished what I set out to do with you folks today. Um, I feel I made a nice display. I've already taken my photos for my Etsy shop. Sorry about the mosquitoes. It's bad. It's a very humid, hot day here today. Um, let me know what you think. If you want to see more videos like this on display, I do a lot of them. I'd be happy to share. I've got a lot of great um, places, you know, that I take photos around my house. I I'd be more than happy to assist. If you have any questions, just let me know. So uh, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed it. I'd love to hear what you say. And until next time, peace, love, and practice kindness. And on a hot day like today, I'm going to down this water. And then I may just hop in the pool. See you later. Bye-bye.